Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Katherine Herr. And I'm Brian Dorman. Funeral services will be held for fallen Selma police officer Gonzalo Carrasco tomorrow, beginning in Fresno with the service and ending in Reedley with the burial. CBS 47's Ben Morris joins us now live to break down what to expect if you're in attendance tomorrow, watching the procession, or traveling through the area. Ben. The main funeral services will begin here starting at around 10 a.m. at Selland Arena. And before that, the procession will be leaving around Belmont Avenue starting at 730 in the morning, traveling down Highway 99 before arriving here around 8 a.m. We just want to deliver the best service possible for the family and, and give them a day to remember their son and their brother. Uh, Officer Carrasco and, and make sure he gets what he deserves. Local law enforcement is putting the finishing touches on Selland Arena for the service tomorrow at 10 a.m. There could be 6,000 plus guests at the service, including law enforcement from across the state and possibly the nation, as well as the general public. 4,100 first come, first serve seats will be available for the public looking to attend. We're encouraging the public to come early. Uh, we are going to have metal detectors outside, so make sure uh, to pack light to go through that screening process. Uh, you don't want to get turned away for having a backpack or something like that. The service will be ending around 1130 in the morning with the procession leaving around noon. It'll be traveling south on M Street before heading north on Highway 41, then east on 180 before getting off on Reed Avenue, which will be closed between Olson and Floral from 12 to 3 p.m. The procession will arrive at the Reedley Cemetery at 1 p.m. That's when and where burial services for Officer Carrasco will occur. We're basically going to use Reed as a park lot for the law enforcement vehicles while they attend. Uh, of course, it, it is open to the public. Nearby Reedley College, Officer Carrasco's alma mater is decorating the area with blue ribbons in his honor. They're asking students, instructors, and the public to come out tomorrow to give him a final goodbye. To have him come through here in his hometown and to go right past the college, it means everything for us to have this opportunity to salute him and to give him a proper um, send off. So we invite the community to join us along Reed Avenue at around noon. There are going to be thousands of people out here tomorrow, and as a result, the city of Fresno is closing off several streets in the downtown area from 6 a.m. to 1 p.m. The following streets will be closed. M Street, Tulare Street, Kern Street, Inyo Street, and both directions of Ventura. San Benito Street will be open until the start of the service at 10 a.m. The city is encouraging the public to use the parking garage on Van Ness. Reporting live, Ben Morris, CBS 47. Ben, thank you so much.